I'm Nancy. I'm Heather. And on today's episode of Tipsy Talk TV, we are talking about the third episode of The Real Housewives of New Jersey. Ooh. Little kid birthday party. Always compelling television. And the cake looks like a vagina. <laughs> this episode brought to you by George Killian's Red. Irish Red. Irish Red. Irish George Killian's Irish Red. Cheers. Cheers. So in this episode, we talk about vagina cakes, boy-girl birthday parties, and I forgot the third thing. Mom ass. Mom ass. <laughs> well, stay tuned. Stay tuned. It's Cheers. That kind of thing lets you whistle. So in today's episode, we're in the middle of Gymgate. Yeah. Oh. There. Teresa and Melissa are both trying to mark their territory at the gym by like peeing in the corner. Each time one of them goes, the other one has to go pee in the same corner to mark their territory. <laughs> After all, humans are just monkeys that wear clothes, when you think about it. <laughs> I wonder, okay, they're talking about whether Melissa's husband, Joe, is going to go to Gia's birthday party, and uh, I'm the, the persuasion that Joe is just faking sick the whole time. What do you think? I think He's so. just, he was just a, he doth protest too much about his diarrhea. <laughs> That's what I think. On camera. Yeah. Saying that he's like peeing out of his butt or whatever. <laughs> so Joe Gorga has soup coming out of his ass. Oh god. I hope it wasn't spicy. It wasn't. Was, but looking back, I'm really glad I wasn't one of those girls that had a boyfriend when they were 11 because those are usually the girls that by the time they're 13, they get caught being fingered in laser tag. And by the time they're 15, they already have a two year old. Just like, and Caroline's trying to make this, you know, make it up, and, and Jacqueline's just done. I, You know, I, I, I feel her pain. She's just been burned by Teresa too many times. And she has enough going on that she doesn't want to put up with Teresa's stupid bullshit. Yeah. So Melissa's kind of, she's like confused why Caroline is intervening in Joe and Teresa's like feud. feud. I guess, I think Caroline really likes them as a couple and also she's gone through with her sister Dina and doesn't want to see the same thing happen to them maybe although or I'm she wants screen time seeing Melissa's point that she just doesn't need Caroline messing in you know I think Melissa's again done with Teresa and I think everybody's a little done well Melissa can't be done with Teresa their family she has to be not done with her Jacqueline can be done with Teresa because they're not family. They were just friends. Yeah, you can be done with family. It's hard, bro. <laughs> so Joe's possibly going to poop his pants like Al Roker at the White House. <laughs> but instead of at the White House, it'll be his, his granite monstrosity <laughs> keyhole windows. It's kind of like... Which is kind of like the White House, I guess. I don't see crap. Another reason why I don't think motherhood would be for me, I don't want to develop a mom ass. Like... <laughs> Poor Kathy. Poor, poor Kathy. And I can't even get notified that a pig needs a foster home, though. Can't you just send it to, like, a slaughterhouse? Like, isn't that where all old pigs go? They become baloney? Baloney's pork, right? <laughs> oh my god, okay, they're at the salon, and Teresa's daughters are such little... Bitches. I can't believe they They're run so, seriously. They, none of them know how to behave. Melania. Uh, Mel Melania is such a biatch. Teresa should have sat up and swallowed that one. I'm into older men. Melania is into older men. <laughs> she should all be. You, all you eight year olds out there better get on that. Melania is single and ready to mingle. <laughs> okay, we're at Gia's boy girl 12 year old birthday party i think her cake is supposed to be like lips but it just looks like a vagina with caviar in it I'm and they misspelled her name is. on the cake so classy um oh and then gia like mom leave me alone what's a biffle what's a biffle mom leave me alone so here's Melissa at the Battle Zone, Space Odyssey. Appropriately named. I think that means laser tag. 
Must be. I haven't seen anybody playing it. Oh, Kim D, of course, is invited to the children's birthday party. What the hell? Who does she this? She doesn't have a child. She, she looks like she's barren. She just gives off that vibe. So I don't know why she'd be there. Tergia doesn't want her there. She Maybe she needs to drink the blood of virgins to stay young. So she's looking for prey. I love that Melissa uses ghost scratch. I've I, never heard of I that. Just, it's it's, it's got to be some New Jersey thing because uh, I never heard it what either. Does it mean? I love ghost scratch. I just like, I think it just means ghost, piss off. Oh, wait. Piss off. It's a California piss off. Ghost oh. scratch. <laughs> I'm so unenthused about what's going on. Because can we get a better episode? Tell. We need better episodes. Spoiler, Spoiler alert. <laughs> alert. The episode ends with the vagina cake being cut and Melissa storming out. 